guys, today I have a quick grocery haul for you guys. I just got back from Trader Joe's and Sam's Club and we got some good stuff so I wanted to show you guys. Um, we don't do all of our grocery shopping there. I usually will do quite, kind of like a bigger haul at the beginning of the month and then throughout the month just kind of like get things that we run out of or if we feel like having something different that I didn't plan for uh, at the beginning of the month we'll go out and buy stuff for it. Sometimes I just forget to buy things and we have to go out but um, we just walked in the door. I don't know if you can hear Evan over there. Um, we just walked in the door and we have some freezer stuff that needs to be put away. So I'm going to go ahead and show you guys really quickly what we bought so I can get everything put away. Okay. Okay, so first we bought some of this tzatziki sauce and we're going to eat this with these pita breads. Um, and I'll show you, actually let me just... So we like to eat this on a pita bread and then I roast some garbanzo beans with paprika, chili powder, and some salt. And then we cut up some onions and that makes a really good and kind of healthy dinner. So we're actually gonna have that tonight. We also got some bagels, just some everything bagels. We've really been liking bagels around here lately so we got a pack of those. I uh, got a pack of organic Fuji apples. We're not really too strict when it comes to eating organic. So, I mean, we buy stuff that's not organic. But these were, I think, $2.99 for all these apples. So, got a bag of those. Got some eggs, some bananas. Ezra's really the only one who eats bananas. And they turn brown right away. So, we ended up just getting three of those. Got a bag of avocados some string cheese, some naan. I've never actually had this kind of naan before. We usually get the kind from Costco, but usually we keep those in the freezer. We don't end up eating them all and they get freezer burned. So we got a small pack of those. Um, these over here, just a red bell pepper, a tomato, and a red onion. We got some of these little goodies for Ezra. They're just some fruit strips, apple raspberry and apple strawberry. These are, we only got two because they're like real treats for him. We don't give him those all the time at all. We got some gnocchi that we are going to prepare with this basil pesto, which I've never tried before. Anthony really likes pesto. I'm kind of whatever about it, but we'll see how that goes. Um, we got this, which we've never tried before, but we love Thai green curry. So bought a jar of this and we're gonna eat that with uh, probably chicken, that bell pepper, and maybe some onion or something. We got a jar of peanut butter. Anthony likes to put peanut butter in his smoothies. You saw the garbanzo beans. This is just some masala simmer sauce. So we're gonna eat that with some probably chicken and the naan, some white cheddar corn puffs. In my opinion, these are actually better than Pirate's Booty. Pirate's Booty, I feel like as soon as you open the bag, they get hard right away, so we end up wasting some of the bag. Uh, these are actually probably half the price of Pirate's Booty and they last a lot longer. They have a better texture, I think. We got some, oh, okay, so that's everything. Oh, actually, no, we got this too. Just a sparkling water, nothing too exciting. Never tried this flavor before, cranberry clementine, so that should be good. Okay, so that's everything we got at Trader Joe's. Let's move on to Sam's Club. So first we got some oven roasted turkey breast. This is actually a pretty big pack. It's one pound, six ounces. So uh, we eat sandwiches a couple times during the week. And we got some honey barbecue boneless chicken bites. We wanted to get the buffalo, but Ezra doesn't eat buffalo. Obviously they're really spicy, so we got these so he can enjoy them with us. We got this huge, oh my goodness, jar of salsa. We've never had this kind before, but it looked good, so we're gonna give it a try. We're gonna eat that with these chips back there. We got some raspberries. Uh, Ezra eats fruit with pretty much every meal, so these should last us maybe, I don't know, three or four days, if we're lucky. We got a loaf of bread, some strawberries for smoothies, like I said, we're not too crazy and 
too picky when it comes to eating organic versus not organic. Uh, we usually get our strawberries for smoothies at Costco, and I believe it's a five pound bag for about $9. This was a three pound bag for I think almost $8, but this is all they had, so that's what we got. We needed strawberries, so. We bought those, and then last thing we got is this huge box of baby wipes. Both of our kids are still in diapers, hopefully by the end of the week, Ezra is out of diapers, but for now, he does need these, and so does Evan, so. But, <laughs> Evan has a lot to say over there. Uh, so, these are a really, really good deal. They're normally, I think, 17 or 18 dollars for 1152, and then when they go on sale, I believe they're like 14 or 15 dollars for that amount, that's a really good deal. So we always buy our wipes from Sam's Club. So this is what we bought, and that is the haul, you guys. Okay, you guys, so there's one more thing I forgot to show you, so I turned my camera back on. I bought these leggings. It's hard to hold up with just one hand, but they are just regular women's leggings. They're called Lux Leggings and they are pretty thick. You guys are really good quality, and they were $10. I'm really short, so I usually will buy like ankle leggings or like the Capri leggings. It's hard to find leggings because I don't like the ones that end up getting bunched up around my ankles, so they're pretty hard to find. Uh, these are the perfect length, and they're really, really thick. They're really good for winter, as far as I can tell, are not see-through, so uh, if you are a girl and you like wearing leggings and you have a Sam's Club card, I would recommend going to Sam's Club before they sell out and checking these out because for 10 bucks you really can't beat that. I know it's hard to to tell, but um, yeah, they seem like they're really good quality, so I'm excited about that. So anyway, yeah, that is everything. So. So that is it, that was my grocery haul. Thank you guys so much for watching. Let me know if you're interested in seeing more grocery hauls. I would be more than happy to film those for you. Uh, but yeah, that is it. Thanks for watching and I will see you all in my next video. Bye.